okay here my third example is to create a function to get the manager names of all employees okay so if we have employee table and we if we have manager id for each and employee so based on that manager id i want to get the list of manager names for each and every employee okay that is one requirement and i have another requirement so create a function to get the manager and his di direct report is so in the first case uh, every employee will have only one manager but in reverse if you see one manager can have any number of employees reporting to him so in my second uh, example here okay i want to get the manager name and his direct employees uh, employee names separated by a comma okay let's see two functions how it works okay so firstly i am writing a function okay with the name udf manager details and i am uh, my return value is a table that will contain the employee name and his corresponding manager name okay so i am writing this function using sql language and this is my query so this query i already explained many times while explaining the snowflake or sql okay so how to get okay in employees table i ha i will have both employee id i will have employee name i will have and manager id i will have so i have to join this uh, uh, employees table with the same employees table based on the where employee dot manager id equals to manager dot employee id so hope you understood this query this is very simple that's why i'm not explaining in detail okay but uh, how i am getting this employee name and manager name okay so here uh, i have two tab same table but using twice once as a employee and once as a manager okay so employee dot first name concatenated with employee dot last name as employee name manager dot first name uh, manager dot last name concatenate with manager dot last name as manager name from employees table as employee join employees table as manager on employee dot manager id equals to manager dot employee id so this will fetch the manager name of each and every employee present in the table okay so in a reverse case in the uh, so how to call this okay first we will see how to call this so here you can see select employee name comma manager name from table of this whatever uh, the output because this is a tabular right tabular udf how, how you can utilize so you have to convert the result of this function as a table by using table literal okay uh, so i'm just calling this function if you see and converting this as a table so my table has two fields here employee name and manager name i am selecting this employee name and manager name here okay so this is one and in the next case i want to get the manager name and list of employees reporting to that manager separated by a comma so the same code i am writing so if you see uh, the sub query is same for this one okay and this one so but out of this i am writing one more query here by using list tag you know right if you want to fetch a list of values separated by some delimiter so you can use list tag and group by so whatever the uh, for for every manager you are saying right so you have to group by manager so group by manager uh, so get all his reporting uh, reporting employees separated by a comma okay so here also i am writing a function like this uh, my function name is udf direct report is and my uh, it returns a table with the manager name and direct report is both of varchar types okay so i already explained this query okay let's see both the examples how it works okay so this is new udf i'm saying udf third example i'm selecting something like employees hr data okay i have created so if database and schema doesn't exist create them okay and now uh, create this function to get employee name and corresponding manager name okay so i'm selecting this uh so this will return a table right from the table i am getting the employee name and manager name okay udf manager details okay sorry so we are in the hr data schema but this function is present in the 
UDF schema. So you have to write this. Okay. So now you can see. Okay. So Priyanka Gurram, his her manager name is Raj Krishna. So if you want, you can check in the uh, table. Okay. So let's see. Select star from. this table where okay just select this select star from this table okay so 300 so here is the first record itself so priyanka gurram so her manager id is something like so manager id 108 so what is 108 we'll see so 108 is raja krishna so that is what we got right so let's see this see so priyanka gurram is reporting to raja krishna so if you see here so this is my first example and in reverse if you see so here we have uh, a manager okay ramana rao and i have two reporters reporting to him so two employees reporting to him devi kapoor and nagesh reddy okay and if you see here i have ranga raidu okay so for this manager there are four employees reporting to it now my requirement is so if you see here total we got 107 records because we have 107 employees and uh, corresponding manager names but if i group by uh, this manager name i'll get few records so how many number of distinct manager we have those many records will come okay let's see that in the second case okay i'm creating this function udf direct report is okay and i'm calling this function here so manager name and a list of report is reporting to that manager so if you see so this uh, Sandeep Koneti has only one reporty. So, Bhavya Ramesh is reporting. For Raja Krishna, there are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 reporties. Okay, like that you can get all the manager names and corresponding direct reporties names. Okay, so this is also very useful in real time. So, for data analysis or for whatever the reason. So, at the time of appraisals, this list of manager names and uh, uh, list of report is names and for each and every employee who is the manager so if you want to get those kind of details so you can write a function uh, like this okay I hope you understood so with this our UDF's concepts is completed so I have uh, shown you three examples right uh, in each and every example I have showed two two types how you can write a, a UDF okay and UDF I hope this is helpful. Thank you.